we've had a few people ask us to explain the definition of L and B skew. Now the L and B skew is the rotation of the L and B within its holder to a given position. Now it sounds complex but it's rather straightforward really. When you look at our manual you can see that we've sliced Australia up into five wedges. So dark green, light green, dark, light, dark. And we've got zone one, two, three, four and five. Now it is important to have the L and B in the correct position otherwise you could spend all day moving the dish side to side and never acquire signal. So make sure you do this first. So we're in zone one all the way from Tassie up to Gladstone, zone one, Rockhampton etc. Um, zone one up here, zone one plus 30. So while we're traveling this area here we make sure that the L and B is on the plus side and you'll see on the sticker there we've got a plus up at the top and a negative on the other side there and I can rotate this we're lining it up with the top of the join and I'm rotating the entire L and B so that plus 30 is aligned with the join on the holder and plus 30 is zone 1. So if I travel across the Nullarbor, across to Perth, I'm now in zone 4. And if we go to zone 4, it tells me 0 degrees. So if I shot across with this dish without touching the LNB and I shot across to Perth tomorrow and I attempted to use it, it will not work. I have to turn it to the 0 position for zone 4. So that applies no matter where you are, that rule applies all around the country. Just make sure you look at what zone you're in first, set the LNB to the right position, go out, align up your dish in three minutes and watch TV.